The proboscis monkey, known for its distinctive long nose, is an intriguing species native to the island of Borneo in Southeast Asia. Here are various aspects and facts about the proboscis monkey, spanning its behavior, habitat, physiology, conservation status, and more. The proboscis monkey, scientifically known as Nasalis larvatus, belongs to the family Cercopithecidae, which includes Old World monkeys. Within this family, it is categorized under the subfamily Colobinae, which also includes langurs and leaf monkeys. One of the most prominent features of the proboscis monkey is its long, pendulous nose, which is more prominent in males than in females. This distinctive nose is believed to serve various purposes, including amplifying vocalizations, attracting mates, and regulating body temperature. The male's noses can reach lengths of up to 7 inches, 18 centimeter. In addition to their unique noses, proboscis monkeys have pot bellies, reddish-brown fur, and webbed feet, which aid in their adept swimming abilities. Proboscis monkeys are primarily found in coastal mangrove forests, riverine forests, and lowland rainforests on the island of Borneo. They inhabit areas near rivers, streams, and swampy regions where they can find an abundant supply of their preferred food sources, such as leaves, fruits, seeds, and occasionally invertebrates. Proboscis monkeys live in groups called troops, which typically consist of one adult male, multiple adult females, and their offspring. The adult males are dominant within the troop and are responsible for defending the group against potential threats. These troops can vary in size from a few individuals to as many as 30 or more. Female proboscis monkeys reach sexual maturity around four to five years of age while males typically mature later, around six to seven years old. Breeding can occur year-round, although there may be peaks during certain times of the year. Gestation lasts around five to six months, after which a single offspring is born. Infant proboscis monkeys have a striking orange hue, which fades as they mature. Proboscis monkeys are known for their various vocalizations, which include honks, grunts, and alarm calls. The enlarged nasal structure of the males is believed to amplify these vocalizations, allowing them to communicate over long distances within the dense forest environment. These vocalizations play a crucial role in maintaining social cohesion within the troop and signaling potential threats. Proboscis monkeys are primarily folivorous, meaning they primarily feed on leaves. However, they also consume a variety of other plant parts, including fruits, seeds, flowers, and occasionally invertebrates such as insects. Their specialized stomachs are equipped to digest fibrous plant material efficiently. As key inhabitants of Borneo's tropical forests, proboscis monkeys play a vital role in ecosystem dynamics. They contribute to seed dispersal, helping to maintain plant diversity and forest regeneration. By consuming a variety of plant materials, they also influence vegetation, structure, and nutrient cycling within their habitats. The proboscis monkey is a fascinating and endangered species with a distinctive appearance, intriguing behaviors, and ecological significance. Despite facing numerous threats to their survival, ongoing conservation efforts offer hope 
for the long-term protection of these unique primates and their precious habitats in Borneo's rich and biodiverse landscapes. Understanding and appreciating the importance of conserving proboscis monkeys not only benefits this species, but also contributes to the preservation of the entire ecosystem they inhabit. <laughs>